today's video. This is the Shelby the McCord channel. I'm Carly. <gasps> this is Shelby and today we are unboxing a huge box of Christmas toys bought from Northern Parrots. <gasps> Parrots. <laughs> Let's get into it. me today in today's video I have got the world's biggest box of toys ah! bought from Northern Parrots obviously and the theme is ah! Christmas I was gonna wear a Christmas jumper for this video but when I went looking for it I realized I, ah! I must have thrown them all away so there we go in this box I have so many toys and presents for Shelby to enjoy she was running low on toys again and so we needed to get some new ones and so I'm just gonna go through it and show you what we bought. So in the box, it starts off with the standard catalog, which I love going through the catalog to be fair. It has so many things in it, even the food and all sorts of play things, but if not, it provides a good shredding to, uh, toy for Shelby. So that's the first thing that comes with it. Loads of packaging, which obviously great for shredding. Are you coming? Cause people wanna see you, come here. She's intrigued, but she's like, what if it's a snake? <laughs> So this is a little foraging box and on the front, oh my god that is so cute, it's got a little snowman face um, and it's just full of shredding paper really and a little plastic chain it's got there. Um, so she, Shelby loves little boxes and things that have stuff inside them like little things like that, she wants it already. Little boxes and stuff, she absolutely loves these, so I know that this will probably be a great hit with her. She's all going pinny and excited for it. Um, while she's holding this, I'll move on to the next thing. This looked really interesting on the website. Basically, it's a perch, and it's a dowel rod perch, which isn't great, but she doesn't have any dowel rod perches, so it's not the end of the world. But on the end, it's got this spinny cube with loads of like, little cardboard straws hanging out of it. A really great sort of destruction toy that she can really sort of get her hands into or her feet, her beak into even. What do you think of that one? I kind of need to open them all first before you destroy them. Otherwise it ruins it. Next up, so excited about this one, is a cracker. I'm not sure what she'll think of this one because sometimes she's a bit weird with red things. See, she's a bit more wary with these ones. Do you like it? Oh, I love that, that is so cute. It's just a little cardboard cracker, but it's got little shredding stuff in it. Can you go on there? Cause it's, you're hurting me. Also got her a foot toy. She's had this before. Um, but she really likes these. She likes the beads on these especially. Oops. And it's just for her to just, just destroy really. Um, and shred and ruin another great McCaw toy. <gasps> Oh my god, I totally forgot we bought this. What is that? I don't remember buying this. It's a potpourri of different exciting grasses selected for birds of all sizes to pick through. Um, great for all sized birds. Uh, I don't remember buying this. <laughs> Shelby, obviously she's a bird. She loves anything that is natural, like leaves, branches, toys um, that are made of like natural things. Um, things that come off trees, she loves all that sort of thing. So this to her is probably gonna be amazing. Um, obviously I did put it in my basket, but I don't remember doing that. I don't know if you remember the last video we did where we were unboxing toys, but Shelby was far more, um, like she was way more apprehensive in that video and not as confident, whereas in this one, she's like, give it all to me now. Oh, look, what else is in here is a little teddy. What's this? <laughs> This is like a little piñata and it's wearing a Santa thing and again it's just another destruction thing. Obviously McCaws love destroying things and wrecking things and so that is ideal for her and it is super cute just for me to ooh and ah over so love that. Oh my god another piñata. I bet she hates this. Shall we? Look it's a Santa. It's Santa. Oh clever girl. This is so cute. This is like a little Santa piñata. Um, it's just tissue paper really, coloured tissue paper. I mean I could make this myself for probably a third of the price. But, oh it says open the flap in the back and fill it with treats. Oh my, 
<laughs> so you can stuff, there's a hole there and you can stuff that with treats. I didn't even realise that. I bet the other one's got that too. So up next we have, what else do we have in here? So this is another, this is another hanging tip, tri uh, toy. Again, another foraging thing, but the good thing about this one is it's stuffed with tissue paper and coloured things, but it also has bits of plastic and stuff on it as well, because Shelby loves plastic things, toys, that like children's toys and stuff, dog toys that are plastic, so she will love this as well. She's so much more confident this time with all the toys, whereas new toys for some birds are like the most terrifying thing in the world. For her, it's really exciting. Next up is another really cute, one of those cute little boxes from earlier, but this one is a reindeer one. I think this actually came in a set of three, so yeah, there's one more in there. And this one is ooh, a yellow Santa. He's got a funny coloured face, it's like mustard yellow Santa face. But again, another little box for her to, <laughs> to go through and play with. Um, she's really excited by all of these, as you can tell. Do you not want me to get them all out the packaging first? Next, oh, next up, oh, look at this. This is a little tree, oh, I love that. So this could be her Christmas tree in her cage. But this has got massive beads on it. She absolutely loves these beads. She breaks them off, love these stars. And then it's got, looks like leather rope going through it. And um, this can go in her cage because this can be her like Christmas tree of her cage, which I love the idea of that. Ooh. Up next we have, a, oh, I think this is another tree thing. Oh, it's got jingly jangly bells on it. Oh, look. What is this one, Bobby? So again, this is this can go in your cage as a Christmas tree too. This is another Christmas tree type thing. This one actually has bells. Oh, maybe this won't go in her cage actually because she sleeps at night with us. And that's going to make a lot of noise. Um, but yeah, again, another little Christmas tree to decorate her areas with. Has nice bells on it, ropes, and again, her favourite beads. And also, I love these ones because the chain through the middle you can keep and use for other toys. So, love that. So, oh, this is cute. You back and forth, back and forth. This is really cute. This is an actual metal tin bucket. And again, she just loves buckets and boxes and things like this that have an open top that she can get into. Um, but, oh, you really want that one. <laughs> it's got bells on it. It's like a little Santa bucket, I suppose. Ah. And we can stick little treats in there for her to go through. She will love this one as well. Any sort of bucket toys are her faves. So off you go with that one, my sweet. <laughs> another couple of foot toys here. Feet toys are great for the feet. Uh, just another few little uh, wrecking toys and things that she can just destroy. Ah. I like to get these because um, she just loves them. She enjoys those ones. So this, I decided to get this as well. This is like a little plastic um, nuts and bolts type thing. It looks like a child's toy. Again, I'm pretty sure I could have found something on eBay ah. similar to this that is a lot cheaper, but there we go. But this is just a little plasticky thing. Like I said, ah. she absolutely loves plastic toys. That is again, something that she will no doubt love. This is a monster, and I don't know if I accidentally ordered two of these because it looks like there's another one in there. But this, what the hell is this? Oh, it's like a wreath. Oh, look, you can. So this is like a little, oh, not little at all, large green um, rope, uh, sort of like preening toy. It's covered in red beads. She loves the red beads. So this sort of looks like a holly wreath, I guess. Um, and yeah, this is, oh, it's got a metal <gasps> metal ring throughout the middle. So I don't know how she's gonna feel about this one, to be honest. She's not really the preening type. She doesn't really do a lot of preening. Um, and it would appear I accidentally bought two of those. So that's useful. Two Christmas wreaths, because you can never have enough of these beautiful Christmas decorations. Um, what else, what else? And that's it. That is all of the Christmas toys and um, Christmas sort of products that were that we bought from Northern Parrots. I think they have quite a big range at the moment online of all these little Christmassy things for your birds to love. So if you haven't already, go check it out. I highly recommend it. Northern Parrots is great for toys um, and all these lovely little bits for your birds to get into and destroy. It saves them destroying the rest of the house. So. If you've got anything from Northern Parrots, let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, um, just let me know what sort of videos you want to see from us, really. We're sort of 
new to the YouTube thing, people, most people here followed us over from TikTok and our videos over there are popular but for YouTube we're stumped, what do you want to see? These videos are longer so we don't really know what you want to see but if you have any ideas drop them down in the comments below, if you haven't already please subscribe to our channel, give this video a big fat thumbs up and we will see you in the next one, bye!